Welcome to Frank Bruno Law. Continuing on 34, common estate planning traps and what to do to avoid them. So I'm on uh, the section where it's ignoring the possibility of your own incapacity. It's a section, uh, I've broken down the 34 into sections. Number 19, not having a financial power of attorney, right? Financial power of attorney, uh, also called or can be a durable power of attorney. The durable, durable, durable power of attorney, that aspect of the power of attorney means that it will last past incapacity, right? So what do we think of when we think of a durable, Doracell, right? Ever ready, or that's the other battery company, right? But it's something robust, strong, um, uh, continuing on and on, um, nearly everlasting. A power of attorney is valid if made when a person has capacity and it lasts all the way up until uh, the, the person that makes the power of attorney cancels it or revokes it or the death of that person. So the power of attorney lasts uh, during incapacity. Uh, should you not be able to make decisions for yourself, the power of attorney continues on and it allows your agent to, uh, well, it, whatever among the enumerated powers that you give to the agent, run your business, invest for you, go to the bank. If you tell them uh, or give them this power, open up a bank account, file a Medicaid application, give a gift. You have to enumerate your initial, there's a place and a way and a method to do the power of attorney. You just wanna make sure that it's done right uh, because you may not get a second bite at the apple if uh, you've made this power of attorney. Right, so last week, let me, let me give you an example. Um, I received a call from uh, an adult uh, child. Her father um, is in a uh, sort of a rehab facility. He was uh, in a hospital to a rehab, back into the hospital, and uh, she needs to uh, take control of uh, his situation. And we may have to do a guardianship for him. She does not have a power of attorney. The power of attorney could eliminate the need for a guardianship. It's a, uh, a document that has um, a power, <laughs> pun intended, uh, and a usefulness that belies um, its possible simplicity and low cost, right? So you have to have the power of attorney before you actually need it. So if you're skeptical of giving that uh, immense authority to someone, maybe you can uh, really uh, draft the power of attorney now, sign the power of attorney now, and keep it for yourself, hide it. Keep it um, uh, among your personal belongings with your treasured documents. And this way, if you ever need it, it's there and available. So there's much more that I could say about the power of attorney, but I will save that for another day. Everyone be well, be safe, uh, wear a mask when appropriate, socially distance when appropriate, and vote, right? Your vote counts. Every vote counts. And be a part of the process. Thank you very much.